This is Jim Nalon, liturgical guitarist, and I'm going to share my arrangement of Immaculate Mary. First, I'll play it slowly. Now you can find the sheet music for that through the link at the bottom of the YouTube video or possibly also through my uh, website. And uh, it's at scoreexchange.com um, and you can print that out for free. So I'm going to talk through the sheet music now quickly, chord by chord, <coughs> uh, starting measure one. It's a the pick up there, the open third string, then a C chord, and you're simply playing an arpeggio. Simple arpeggio. Then the same thing on the A minor, next chord. Regular, regular fingering on all of those. Then the D minor, a little change in the fingering here. Notice I use the little finger on the third fret of the second string. So I can bring my third finger over for the third fret of the fourth string on the second beat. And then my third finger goes over third fret of the sixth string and I play the open first and second strings there for that G6 and then the last measure just a C. A couple of bass notes. Repeats the same thing. Now since the second line is exactly the same almost you may want to vary the tone a bit and you can do that by taking the right hand and shifting it to the right or towards the bridge and you get what's called metallico. So instead of you get So. Then you can bring it back up again. You don't have to do that, but that's a little technique from classical guitar that, that varies the tone and makes things a little more interesting. Sometimes I'll use it, sometimes I don't. So the third line, measure 10. You're on a regular G7 chord. You're just playing up the arpeggio, then a C chord bass run here on the G with your melody line on the third fret of the second string using your little finger holding that note and playing a bass run open fifth string second fret of the fifth string then a C chord and now your little fingers over on the third fret of the first string to get the melody line and then back to the last line there G7 this time on the C we're going to Play the second and third fingers, or the, um, the AM fingers on the right hand, and alternate with an, a drone on the um, an open third string, and then G G with the melody on the thir second string, third fret, and then open first string, third fret of the second string, and then the C. So that's basically. Um, how to play through it. This is probably the easiest arrangement in the liturgical guitarist hymnal. Um, I provide my arrangements primarily as sketches um, that you can embellish. And so if I was playing this, I, I pr play it usually a little different every time. I, I never read the music. Um, so it could sound something like this. sucker for that big church ending ending so anyway that's kind of how I 
would uh, play Immaculate Mary. And that's all for this hymn. Uh, look for more videos of my arrangements on liturgicalguitarist.com. And I pray God blesses your playing and your service. And I wish you peace.